What you do was poppin'. It's your girl back at it again. Um, you already know how it goes. Turn the volume down a little low. Um, messaging me. People are messaging me. It's annoying me. Okay, sorry. So today we finna talk about a topic that is very controversial. It's no different about a dead ass so it's really not. So we got this guy. His name is. Patrick Peterson or something like that. Let me just double check. Patrick. Yeah, Patrick Peterson. He plays for the uh, Clippers. Um, so during an interview. Sorry, I was looking at my phone. During an interview uh, regarding his one-year anniversary with his wife, who I may mention is white, he explained black women as being bulldogs. Interesting, right? crazy you see okay the thing about this is this happens a lot like i've even experienced this as a black girl like black guys bashing black girls all the time for no reason i just want to say before we get into this let's look at the logistics okay okay so patrick peterson you're married to white women cool that's your preference i right, bet whatever who did you come from your mother white I mean, your mother, sorry, your mother, black. Your grandma, black. Um, are they women? Yes. So you're calling your grandma and your mother a bulldog. So you're saying you came from a dog. That must make you a bitch, okay? So, um, yeah, let's let's get into it now that I you know, got that out. Um, okay, so, yeah, this happens a lot. Black guys, I feel like you need to step it up. Like, this cannot be happening. Like, okay, you could have a preference. You could like white. You could like Indian, Asian, whatever you like. That's fine. That's you. You could do you boo boo. I ain't gonna say ish. But I have a problem when you start talking about black women as a whole as being um, a dog, being ratchet, being ugly, da 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 da, this, that, and the third. Like, that's not how it works, okay? You can, if you don't, how can you diss someone? Listen, we went through slavery together, okay? We both encountered slavery. Not one of us, not just a woman, not just a man, but both of us, all black people. So for you to now see yourself as something other than a black person or try to change the fact that you are you don't want that black history or whatever is like so sad to me. You don't know where you come from, obviously, because how can you not know where you come from? And I don't know, bro. This whole thing doesn't make sense to me. What? Like, it doesn't make sense. This happens all the time. Black guys, there's a lot of black guys who I just think are so insecure in the fact that they're, like, the history. They, there's a lot of black guys that say, oh, I don't want my kids to have um, kinky hair, so I want to marry a white woman. I don't want my kids to have dark skin, so I'm going to marry a white woman. Like, oh, my gosh. You guys sound so dumb. Like, wow, that's crazy. That's crazy. So, basically... You are, this is very extreme, um, so I will accept all the criticism and whatever comes with this, but basically, so what you're saying is you're trying to commit a genocide against your own race. That's what you're saying. You're saying you don't like your race, okay? You're saying, I don't want my kids to look like me. I know it might be based on your experiences, experiences or the experiences of black people, but the fact that you're so set on not having your kids look like you or not wanting a wife that looks like you or not wanting to associate with the culture only the poor part of the culture that's really sad like you don't even know who you are or where you come from like best believe if i liked a different race other than black i would not be bashing black guys because like what does that have to do with me if i'm not dating one then but if you, I just don't understand this whole thing. And then on top of that, you see a lot of um, artists now. Like, I guess it's a good thing, but it's still kind of controversial for me. Like, a lot of artists um, try and include more dark-skinned women in their music video. But the same guys that say they're woke and they like um, the Ebony Queen, like Wale and da 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 I don't know the guys. They be the ones that go for the light thing. Like, I mean, I'm not really pressed, but it's just like, okay, like, that's when I feel like they're trying to cater to a certain demographic of dark-skinned women. Like, oh, they're trying to say, I love dark-skinned women, but it's kind of like 
in a twisted way where it's like they want you to consume their product you know like it's not really genuine and that's the part that bugs me it's like we're try they're trying to um gain another market by being like yeah we're pro-black women like we love you guys da -da 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 -da, this that and the third but deep down they don't even believe it for themselves because they'll still be the ones going after the light skin or the white women in the clubs and in the parties and just giving them attention you know so i don't know that's my basic opinion on this not that deep but I, well it is that deep but i'm saying i'm not going into that much detail because you know it's a deep type of heavy topic and uh, I don't know, it's getting late, I don't really feel like that's for another day, you feel me? But to all you black guys that don't know who you are, better educate yourself because we came from the same history, okay? We can't we experience the same thing and we do to this day. Except black girls feel a little worse and you're making it a little worse for us too because you're also stomping on us along with the, all those other people that are already oppressing us. That's what's crazy to me. So listen, black guys, do your education. Uh, black mothers, educate your sons. Let them know the history of where they came from and how they should respect black girls because we're a part of them, you know, like, we know, you may not marry one of us or whatever, but listen, we experience the same struggles, okay, so we're one and two, okay, so don't be dissing your own, because that doesn't make sense, that's like dissing your own family member, actually that is, so come on, step it up, level it up, okay, we can't be doing that in 2020, we can't have our own people dissing each other, let's level up, okay.